This is our septic system that I converted into a wastewater treatment plant. This is the raw sewage from our house. It's aerated with a pump. It doesn't need a cover because it doesn't smell. The aerobic bacteria break down the waste actually quite rapidly. Then the water flows from there to the settling section of the tank. We're growing water hyacinths in the water because they live off the nutrients and their, um, their roots uh, actually work to purify the water. That round white circle there with the handle on it, that's a filter which keeps the sediment from getting out of the tank. Then the water goes from there to a catch basin. This, um, this basin fills up before the water continues to the pit. So this, the, the, the flow of water favors this basin first. So it always fills up before moving on to the, to the pit. And we pump water out of this basin. That's that gray pipe on the side there. We pump it out with just an old-fashioned iron pump. It needs to be primed. And then from the buckets, we take and uh, we irrigate our trees. We have about 25 fruit trees, and this allows us to recover all of the water from our house and use it again in the yard. And what hasn't been installed yet is a sump pump, sump pump with a automatic float. That will be installed in the basin here. And I have a 660 gallon uh, tank, storage tank, that will be installed at the upper corner of the property. And um, the sump pump will automatically keep this basin empty and constantly be filling up the tank and uh, so that no, no water from our house will make it to the pit. Everything will be recovered. So, uh, that's the system. It's not a gray water system. This is a black water system, which processes, which begins with the raw sewage and ends with agricultural grade water to use in our yard.